for the main amplifier, I have an Ankyo Integra TX SV919 THX amplifier. This thing has the Lucasfilm THX certification on it, and it carries also Dolby Surround Pro Logic. So this system is the perfect marriage for a LaserDisc. In addition, it also has the capability of adding on an external AC3 decoder through a DB25 port connection. And right above the Ankyo dual cassette deck is the Rattel Digital Surround Adapter RDA980 AC3 demodulator or decoder. This is the one that does the demodulation to get the AC3 digital sound. It uses RCA jacks to attach itself to the laser disc player. And then, of course, it has the DB25 connection straight out to the receiver. And this is a very excellent piece of hardware. It does the job and then some. Right above the AC3 decoder is none other than the venerable Pioneer DVD, LD, CD, CDV player, DVL 700. And this is the one that has the EC3 RF RCA out jack that allows for the AC3 de the demodulation. This laser disc is approximately a mid range player. The player's bigger brother is the Pioneer Elite DVL-90. This player has been very good. It's got a tremendous chapter search. And in addition to that, it has a quick side A to side B flip over. And right below the Ankyo THX certified amplifier is none other than Pioneer Elite CLD-97 reference CD CDV LaserDisc player. This player features boat side play and it features outstanding audio reproduction. This model is an outstanding CD player and a solid LaserDisc player. For the DVD side of the equation I have Ankyo TX SR603X. This is the main amplifier that does all my DVDs. I have two changers hooked up to it. And this one offers the Dolby Digital EX as well as the DTS variations. Right below the amplifier is none other than Sony DVP CX 777ES. 400 DVD disc changer. This disc player is the Sony ES line, which stands for Elevated Standard or similar Pioneer's Elite line. This thing also does Super Audio CD, among other features on it. This has been an outstanding player. I recently had to change the belts for it that open the disc drawer and make the uh, carousel move around inside. But other than that, it's been an outstanding player, circa around 2003. And now for the other DVD changer I have is none other than Sony DVP-CX850D. It's a 200 disc changer. This unit features Dolby Digital and DTS capability. And I do have this thing hooked up through an optical jack in order to get that decoding correctly.